Hey guys, Ken here from Playing Numbers. Today I'm talking to you about why it's never too late to learn how to code. On my journey to becoming a data scientist, I found that from the onset, coding was one of the most intimidating things for me to start doing. After I really started getting into it, I think I took a couple courses on Code Academy, I realized that it was all about problem solving and that the concepts were fairly straightforward. There was also nothing quite as satisfying as seeing your code run and it actually executing without any errors. At the most basic level, coding is very straightforward. You're simply issuing commands for the computer to execute. You have a couple main tools, you have variables, you have functions, and you have loops. And these are really the building blocks of everything that you make. If you want to do something more complex, especially outside of the realm of data science, pretty much everything that's out there has already been built for you in the form of modules and packages. In data science specifically, you basically just have to run different training data through pre-created modules to get an output. It's excellent that there are a lot smarter people than me who have already built these things. It definitely helps to have an understanding of the underlying code, especially the math associated with some of these algorithms, but it's not by any means a necessity. I'm also a believer that there are very few people out there that actually know how to, to code. I've gotten my master's in computer science and I still don't think that I'm by any means a proficient coder. I know where to look when I have a question and I am looking far more often than I'm actually typing into a development environment. Stack Overflow and the documentation for any of the modules you're using is far more valuable than memorizing a whole bunch of code. Learning this skill is also very accessible because there's so many free resources out there online. I like YouTube a lot, obviously, but Udacity, Udemy, Code Academy, where I learned, I'm not sure if it's still free, but these are great ways to learn in a fairly formalized setting without having to have any real cash outlay. I think that if you have a specific learning style, there's definitely a way to find something that caters to your needs online somewhere. I'm really happy that I dedicated the time and learned how to do this. And I think that especially if you're considering a, a career in technology or in data science, this is something that behooves you to get started as quickly as possible. Because the landscape is constantly changing and you can learn one coding language and if you know it, it's fairly easy to pivot to learn other ones. And that being adaptable, understanding how to learn new concepts quickly is the most useful skill that you can actually develop. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, please like it. If you enjoy more content like this, please shoot me a subscribe. Thank you so much.